Hi everyone! Welcome back to the Joy Donkey Gigi channel and this is Gigi and today we are going to be opening <laughs> a holiday collection. I think this is my second holiday makeup collection because I just really like holiday collections. Not just because I like Christmas very much but I just feel that the colors that they put out in holiday collections are just brighter and just more festive because it's for the holidays and holidays are all about get-togethers and parties and all those stuff so I think that's why the, the colors are, are much nicer and bolder and sparklier if there ever was such a term so today I'm going to be op op opening two holiday sets two completely different holiday sets um, if you base them on the price point, because one is not that expensive, but not on the affordable side, even if I bought the set from Ulta. And then the other is a drugstore brand, so it's much, much more cheaper than the other holiday set. Should we start with the um, more famous one? <laughs> Okay, the first holiday collection that I'm going to open is the one that I bought from Ulta. Since I'm in Canada, there was additional shipping cost and um, it did take a while to get here. But it's fine because we're at the holidays anyway and it's not even the holidays yet. Well, technically we just passed the Canadian Thanksgiving so that's basically still a holiday. Anyway, so what I've got here are two stuff from the... Kylie Cosmetics um, holiday collection for Ulta. I didn't get the trial kit one because I've seen a lot of people review it already so I pretty much already know what's in there. So I got, I already forgot what I got. So I got the Kylie Jenner um, press powder palette. There's so much glitter on it that it's like when I took it out of the bag it's all over my fingers now. Anyway, so this um, palette has 14 colors made in the USA and the colors look like this. Kylie always has like the really pretty kind of packaging and adding this sparkly glitter of a mess is just just makes it more prettier, makes it more holiday-ish and there's more glitter there with the stars. It's actually pretty heavy. I guess there's a lot of products. So it's supposed to say Kylie. I don't know if you can read it, but it's the same baby pink um, hue on packaging. And then we have the colors here, the 14 colors that they have. It ranges from the very light to a little bit of the somewhat dark. I'll swatch them all for you. They've got really cute, really cute names. We've got seven mattes and then seven glitter, so that's pretty cool. And then there's this one very shocking pink color. We got it all swatched out for us, and it did take out because there's 17 shades, it did take a lot of real estate on my arms, but that's the life of a person who swatches things. So here we go. It's, it's going to be a marathon. This very sheer one right here. It's called Martini Mama. Um, it's a, a sparkle, a sparkly, sheer kind of flesh tone color. And then next to it is the raspberry sugar sparkly um, champagne sort of color. And then the very pinkish Barbadell one is called Chick ID. And then this one is called Be Mine. It looks very different on the pan. It's like more fleshy on the pan, but um, when I put it on my skin, it looks more pink. This bright pink one is called Candy Heart with a K, Candy Heart. And then this um, sparkly brown bronzy one is called Pray for Snow, which is something I'm not really looking forward to here <laughs> in Atlantic Canada. And then this one is called Payback Bitch. 
All right, but I think it's a very lovely matte color, so it's good for crease. So, second round. This one is called Rosé. Oh, it does have that wine color. Very, very light color. Um, this one's called Forever Young. I feel like I'm going to use this a lot, this matte pink one. And then this one's called Amen. It's really pretty. Um, dark, brownish, purple color. The next is Love Bug. This one, sorry. I kind of ruined it, but it's really pretty. It's supposed to be a glittery type of eyeshadow. Next to it is the Jack Frost. This one is Jack Frost. And then second to the last is Bikini Mama. And the black one is called Obsidian. So when I was swatching it, I don't know if it's just me because I'm just a really bad swatcher. I don't know if that's the adjective for that. But it, w it took quite a while for me to get the pigment out of my fingers. Like I had to really rub it in. I don't know if I use a brush, brush if it's gonna give um, more pigment to the bristles, but I kind of use my fingers more and yeah, I guess it would take more than one dab on the pan to get the color that I want. So that's just my initial reaction to this, but you know, we'll see as the days go by how good it will be. So along with the palette, I also ordered the Kylie Jenner Lip Collection. Gosh, it looks... It looks so messy because of the glitter, but anyway. So this is a five-piece mini um, lipstick set. So they're uh, mini matte liquid lipsticks. Um, there's Autumn, One Wish, Angel, Bite Me, and Under the Tree. Actually, Autumn, One Wish, and Angel are three colors that I actually wanted to get. So I'm very, very happy that um, she put them in this mini collection. So they look like this. They're so pretty. Um, I think it's really good as a stocking stuffer as well. Um, it's so pretty and I'm not actually very good at using lipsticks every day. So I don't really empty out lipsticks that much anyway. So having a mini lipstick with the really nice colors is a really good thing for me. I do like these colors because they're mostly nude or pinkish. So it's good when you've got like a heavy, heavy eyeshadow game going on. Every time I open a box, glitter's just like, it's a glitter explosion all over my pants. The first one that I have is called Autumn. And this is the color. Oh my gosh, the color. The color is so nice. It's so pretty and um, it's just a cross between peach and pink for me and I think this is something that I would really use every day. It's so pretty. It does, it is really an, it's really an autumn color so, oh, so excited to use this. So the next one that we have is called One Wish. This is the color on the tube. It's a very light pink. This is the color um, upon optication. It's so pretty, so um, sheer nude. Or sheer pink I don't know how to describe it but this is very good when you've got a heavy eye makeup when you've got a lot of dark dark colors it's really really gonna be pretty so that one's called one wish the third one that we got is called angel and it looks like this on the tube it's also a very pinkish color so this one has got a mauve kind of um, mauve slash pink kind of color to it Ugh. I just, I can't describe it. It's so pretty. Everything's just so pretty and would fit most of eye makeups actually, really. It's very natural looking as well. So I'm super excited to use this. So this one is called Bite Me and this is the holiday red color. This is like intense red, like poison, maleficent. Kind of red, but this is actually Christmas party red, the kind that you wear to all the glittery Christmas parties that you go to. So that's the kind of red that this is, which is pretty awesome as well. It looks really nice on a black dress. 
The last one we have it has a pink U and it's called Under the Tree. And it's got this bright pink fluorescent color on the tube. The color payoff is amazing. That's like electric Barbie pink. And I can already imagine a lot, a lot of girls rocking this kind of color in like parties. So this is actually pretty exciting and it's something that I do want to try actually in the future. So I'm pretty happy this kind of color is included in this set. Okay, so all in all, actually, this is um, a really good palette for the holidays. And not just for the holidays, but also for everyday use. Because um, as you can see, everything's pretty usable. Like when you just want to get dolled up, this is actually a very good buy for just making yourself pretty every day and make yourself cute. These five mini lipsticks are actually a very good deal because you get to sample all these really nice colors um, for such a good price. I like sample, sampling stuff and having these at my disposal is like a really good thing because you know I get to just purchase um, things that I like and just you know, not used to things that I don't like and not feel bad about it because there's just a little bit of them here. And then the second collection that I wanted to open up with a much lower price point is from Essence. I just found it in a drugstore and this one is actually just $15 compared to the Kyla Collection one. Um, this Essence one is called From Santa With Love and it's made in Taiwan. So I guess that's also the reason why it's much, much cheaper. And what's interesting is that the colors look very much alike from the Kyla Cosmetics palette. <laughs> Except that it's got like the really deep purple um, U here. I really, really think that the color collection here are really pretty um, because of the pinks and the glitters and all of those things. But I guess there's like a very big difference with the Kyla collection, uh, Kyla Cosmetics palette, right? Okay guys, so unfortunately, the Essence palette from Santa with Love that has 12 really pretty shades do not have names. So, I don't know how I'm gonna show these to you guys. So the, I guess the first four are these ones, that one. So this is the next four. This is the last row. The matte ones actually were kind of similar to the Kylie palette where like the consistency was the same, like the smooth um, powdery finish kind of consistency. But these glittery ones, like these ones that are almost like foil, they were very, very hard to swatch to get out of the pan. But the payoff is really nice. Like, see how intense that is? That's really, really nice. It's like holiday disco fever, right? So yeah, um, for $15, it's actually very nice for a holiday collection. But I feel like this is more of a holiday collection really than for everyday use compared to the Kylie Cosmetics palette one. Essence also has like the five um, lip bundles but I wasn't able to get one because they sold out in the few drugstores close to me. So I only got three of the liquid lipsticks that were included in their um, holiday lip bundle. The, these lipstick lip glosses what interested me to buy them this one is made in italy this one is made in germany but this one is made in italy there were two others but i wasn't able to find them That's, this is what they look like and then we can just swatch them it has a very very fruity scent you know how they have like those for kids kind of um lip glosses it really smells like that so that's the sheer pink one and this is called uh, friends of glamour and then so this is one is just transparent it's a really good top topper for your um, lipsticks this extreme shine lip gloss is called holiday in a bottle and 
It looks like this. I actually am looking forward to using this because it looks like those everyday kind of ones. Colors that I do wear and it's exactly what I thought it would be. It looks very glossy and I, I kind of want to try it. It looks really pretty. Okay, very glossy. Not that sticky and it does have that very fruity scent that is reminiscent of kid makeup, kids makeup. I think these are really good glosses. For the price that they have, they're really, really good. And the palette, um, it's okay if you want to try the the gloss, the glittery um, colors that they have. Uh, for $15, it's, it's, it's a good deal. It's okay. And um, yeah, it's got some colors that you'd want to use over and over again. But I don't know what else to say about it. It's, it's an okay palette. For me. How do I compare between the two? This one and this one, they're both wins for me. So I didn't really want to do like a head-to-head -head battle with the two of them because they're like two completely um, different products for the lips. But the palette, Kylie Cosmetics one wins for sure. So, so that's my review of my <laughs> latest holiday makeup hoarding. Thank you for staying with me and I hope to see you soon in my next video. Bye guys.